yo, what is up with men? And I know this is always a topic up here, but I'm generally speaking about why do men have a hard time helping women? Because we have more important things to do, like watching paint dry. Something that I have observed, not only in my personal life, but literally in the outside world, because I'm a watcher. Men will stand there. The women will have all the bags, the kids, the suitcases, the luggage. We should be doing everything. He's just standing there. They'll just be standing there, like just watching the woman suffer as if it brings them some kind of pleasure. Well, yeah. It's kind of like watching the same people who say they don't need men because they're strong and independent fail at being strong and independent, refuse to ask a man for help, then cry about it on TikTok. It's ironic. Not just ironic, it's freaking hilarious. From my perspective, sweetie, listen, it's 2024, not 1924. If you lovely ladies need help with anything, don't ask men, go ask the bear. Leave me alone, please leave me alone. Leave me alone, please leave me alone. I'm like 27, I go to church and I've started looking for a spouse. So when you say like 27, was that like eight years ago? Sweetie, if you're gonna insinuate that a man is older than he says he is, take off your makeup first. <laughs> I meet so many girls where it's just like, it's just like, oh yeah, I'm gonna go to the gym, make myself super attractive, and I'm only gonna date him if he's like good looking and wealthy. They're, they're thinking, oh, he just cares about so I'm just gonna care about his looks and if he's wealthy or not. Oh, so you're broke and someone said you're not cute. Well, yeah, he very well might be. Now, sweetie, could you show us the content of your wallet and also take off that makeup? It'd be a lot cooler if you did. <laughs> Girls just aren't the way they used to be. They're not. Oh, shut up. Comrade, back in 2014, when my wallet and bank accounts were so empty that I couldn't even afford to pay attention, guess what? I was still getting laid because I was in good physical shape and I knew how to fight. So... If the women you want are in the gym making themselves super attractive, stop complaining on TikTok. Yeah, just like a woman. Go to the gym, make yourself super attractive, and also learn how to fight because most women love feeling safe and protected. As for the whole finding a spouse and getting married thing. If you think this has a happy ending, you haven't been paying attention. Have you ever dated anyone in the military? No, I f a lot of military guys. <laughs> With the troops. I'm banging a couple of Marines right now. What? I'm banging a couple of Marines right now. Yeah. Last time I saw her, she was doing all of H&S Company. She doesn't deserve you, man. No. Are you a, a liberal? God, no. <laughs> <laughs> but why? Well, guess what, man? We don't taste that good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Hillary Clinton and I approve this message. 100,000 Icelandic women singing together, after walking out of their jobs for one day, shutting down society to demand a more equal society, almost one third of the whole population. So, you lovely ladies wanted to prove to us nasty male patriarchists that your role in the workforce is so important that if you all stopped working for a day, the country would shut down and we nasty men can't function without your labor, so we should give you more rights? Is that the point you are trying to make? Yeah, pretty much. Well, sorry to break it to you, sweetie, but... The fact that you were able to buy a coffee and safely demonstrate with a third of your population not showing up for work and yet the water was still running, the planes were still landing, all the stores were open and the economy didn't instantly crash, it means that the country did not in fact shut down. It carried on unbothered that a hundred thousand women out of a population of 377,000 people didn't show up for work. Bruh. So, by creating this quote-unquote women's strike of yours, what you lovely ladies were able to prove logically, realistically, and beyond the shadow of a doubt is that men are the ones who keep civilization going. Congratulations. 
you played yourselves. And that's the bottom line, cause Stone Cold said so. <laughs>